all right so you're trying to install google chrome on your old windows and out of nowhere boom you get hit with this super annoying error chrome setup is not a valid win32 application like what i just downloaded this fresh from google's website and now it's telling me it won't run root now most people would see this and assume oh no maybe my windows is 32 bit and chrome is 64 bit and honestly that is a common issue um, but here's the twist i double check my system and nope my windows is actually 64 bit so what gives and here's what's actually going on and this might sound weird the issue is not with chrome it's with internet explorer yup the same ancient browser that's been around since the dinosaurs if you downloaded chrome using internet explorer on windows 7 there's a good chance the file got messed up or downloaded wrong especially with these older systems so here's the trick to fixing it we're gonna use firefox instead of internet explorer that's it that's the fix it sounds silly but it actually works let me walk you through it real quick first open internet explorer one last time i know it's painful and and search for firefox browser click on the official mozilla website and download firefox don't worry the version it gives you is usually the 32-bit one so it'll work fine with your system Once it's downloaded, install Firefox like normal. When that's done, go ahead and open it up. Then search for Google Chrome, head to the official Google Chrome site, make sure it's the real one, and download Chrome again using Firefox. Now, run the Chrome setup file and boom, no more error, it actually works this time. The setup runs, Chrome installs, and everything's back to normal. You're back online with a modern browser and Internet Explorer can go back to retirement where it belongs. So yeah, that's the fix. Super simple, kind of weird, but it works. If this video helped you out, make sure to smash that like button, subscribe for more tech tips, and let me know in the comments if you ran into this same problem. I want to hear your war stories with Internet Explorer. Thanks for watching and I'll catch you in the next one.